Strictly yeah. speaking, nobody should get over 500 acres without National Assembly approval. That was a crooked deal from the get-go, that they ended up with 2,000 acres in a burgeoning community in a part of the country where there's a land issue, where a full one-seventh of the country is, is isolated and really much um, exclusively for Mayan communal lands. Um, 2,000 acres, that's a no-go from the start. It's something we inherited, um, but the villagers there and much of the people in the Stan Creek and Toledo districts, they want access to those lands. And so those, are, those persons are our focus. We're not about catering to one person for 2,000 acres. It's an illegal process. He shouldn't have gotten 2,000 acres in the first place. But you already signed the contracts. I don't know which contracts. I haven't seen any contracts. He got purchase approval before. This is, this is happening before us. He got purchase approval. Um, he never paid. So the, um, those purchase approvals have been cancelled. He, he never paid within three months that he was supposed to make a down payment to seal the contract. He never did that. I, if you don't develop a land within a few months, that lease can be cancelled. That was just a lease.